my channel and welcome to today's video. Today I've been shopping in Poundland as usual and home bargains again. Yeah, I seem to love these places. They have some amazing bargains. I have a, quite a few staples that I get from those shops that I don't generally get from my regular shopping. But obviously when you're in there, you always seem to spot some really good, really good items and you can't help but pick them up. So first off, we're gonna go to Poundland. I'm gonna share this massive bag with you. I didn't even expect to get that much, but a few bits and pieces from there. So let's go through this bag. So the first thing I picked up was this Gliss Coromis. I, I don't know why I call it Gliss Coromis. It used to be called Gliss Coromis. It's just called Schwarzkopf Gliss at the moment. Um, so I picked up two lots of these because I absolutely love the smell of these. Now I've had the pink one. That was okay. It was good. You know, nice smell and everything, but this one, it just smells divine. Um, I can't get over the stuff and it's a pound each. Um, it's um, They don't do it in home bargains. They only sell it in Poundland um, for that price anyway. Um, but yeah, so I picked up two lots of that because I was running out of the conditioner typically. Um, so yeah, I needed two lots. So I've got two lots of this. That was four quid. Next up as well, I picked up um, one of these nail polishes. Now, I've picked this up a couple of times already and um, my mum, bless her, was saying she never she doesn't get out that much. So she was saying she never gets to see what the nail polishes are like. So I actually picked this up for you, mum. Okay, I know you'll be watching this video. So this one's for mum. I know it's only a pound, but hey. Uh, but yeah, this is the, uh, what colour is it? This is the Scarlet Sparkle. I've got this already. This is the one that I accidentally picked up twice because I literally love the colour. So, Mum, you've got a Scarlet Sparkle coming your way. And then also I picked this one up for you as well, Mum. It's actually quick drying as well. So this one is called, um, what is it called? Oh, this one is called Pink Raspberry. So they're lovely colour and this one on the way to you, Mum, next week when I see you. So there you go, a little present. Right, next up as well, I picked up um, one of these. I've actually drank the Lilt version. So a Diet Fanta and a Diet Lilt for a pound. So pretty good. Next up, I picked up um, this new tumbler. Now I needed a new one for the bathroom because Alice is getting a little bit like, ugh. Um, yeah, we've, it's, I've had it a while. It's really cute. It wasn't cheap. It's got a lovely diamond, di proper diamond diamantes down one side, but it's all like khaki on the inside. Now I'm gonna risk it and I'm gonna put it in the dishwasher. Uh, someone told me that the best thing is to put them in the dishwasher to really get them clean. Now, um, I don't know whether it's gonna hold up in the dishwasher. So in the meantime, I picked up a new tumbler from Poundland. This was a pound, it's a pot as well. I actually thought that it would be plastic, but it isn't. Um, and it's really nice, it's gray, my favorite color. And uh, yes, I picked that up as well. So I thought that was really good. Next up as well, I picked up another brush from my collection. This is obviously the ones with the little sequins inside. Um, this is like a blusher brush, I think. Oh, powder brush, sorry. Mistaken powder brush. Um, yeah, so it's got the flat top this time. So I picked that one up as well. And I also picked up um, a bath bomb in the shape of a diamond, which I thought was really cute as well. They did it in another colour as well, like a grey colour. But I picked up the sort of peachy pink colour because I thought that was nice. Um, so I picked that one up too. Now I did pick up a loaf and some cat food, but hey, who's interested in that? Um, so also, I actually saw the Halloween section and they had some amazing things. So I picked this up. How cute is that? This is a little tea lighter. So when we come nearer to Halloween, how cute would this look here instead of these books? So let's just demonstrate it. Got the orange one. And then we've got this lovely silver one. Now they had a kind of another one which was pretty scary. Um, some sort of clowny kind of thing. Well, uh, not my favorite thing, clown thing. So I thought I'd get this one. So this is like a silver one. This one's the pumpkin one. And I thought that, that, especially with the little lights in them at, at um, Halloween would make a cute little backdrop. So what do you think? Leave me some comments in the description of what you think of the new pumpkins. Uh, but I think they're super, super cute. So that was everything from Poundland. So let's move on to a home and bargain. Right, this bag is like super huge uh, and heavy. And there's quite a lot of stuff in. So we need to obviously crack on. Um, so yeah, so first thing, 
first things first and the reason why it was pretty heavy as well was that I picked up some comfort now I always buy my comfort from like home bargain Poundland those sort of places because you can get this one which is one of the nice perfumed ones for two pounds and everywhere else you're talking three three pound plus so I always wait I don't get it in my shopping and I always pop out and go and get it from um home bargain so this one was two pounds and I got two lots of that also again a staple for me um is this this is my favorite toothpaste mine and Sam's called Rubby you pay a lot more in the supermarket um you're talking three three more than three pound for this this was actually 1.95 in home bargain so i got two i always kind of stock up on these because these are our favorite toothpaste i don't really like anything else i kind of like the gritty there's like a grittiness to them and i quite like that because it feels nice on your teeth it feels like it's getting them super clean right next up as well i did actually find the microwavable bowl so jenny yes jenny has a go um yeah she recommended this on her channel i'll leave her channel details in the description if you're interested in popping over there she does some really good hauls as well um but yeah i thought this was really good it was a pound as i say as she said as well they did it in blue they did it in another color I'm a pink girl, so um, I got it in pink. So oh, this is really good. If you've got like to take pasta to work or a bit of leftover dinner, you can literally warm it up in the tub. Um, I mean, the only thing I don't like about the clear ones, and we have got clear tubs, is that they get stained and we like a lot of curry. I love turmeric, I love spices, and the, the Tupperware kind of gets stained a little bit. So these ones aren't gonna get stained. So um, they actually kind of look nice because they start to look a little bit crappy when, you know, when they've got like curry stains on the plastic. It's not very nice, is it? Um, so yeah, so that'll be handy. Just one for me. <laughs> Clearly I haven't bought one for Sam, but hey. <laughs> right next up as well obviously i love Zaflora, but they have their own in there so i picked up these two now these were i think a pound each so this one is lemon and mint leaves it's obviously um a dupe of Zaflora, and this one's a pink grapefruit now i'm gonna do a bit of a smell test and i know you can't smell it but i can try and describe it to you if you like that is really nice i mean i don't think it may not be as strong as Zaflora. But you never know. Um, it does smell really, really nice. Um, it's concentrated disinfectant, kills 99% of bacteria, cleans and shines, eliminates odors. So it's really good. And you can dilute it like you would have as a flora as well. So I got that one. It's actually a really nice scent. And this one, the pink grapefruit, I think they had another scent, but I kind of didn't fancy the smell. Now that one's a bit more subtle. So yeah, you can smell it definitely, but it is a little bit more subtle. So I got that one as well. Um, not bad for a pound, I suppose. Right, next up as well, I picked up some of this um, Nivea Micellar Water. Um, this is the Skin Breathable one, um, makeup remover. Now, obviously my go-to is the Clarins Peach Water, but it costs so much money uh, that I don't like to use it every day. So I kind of use it sparingly. So in between, I kind of use cheaper ones so this one was one pound 50 i think i got this um nivea one so i thought i'd give that one a go i think i've tried it before but um but i think it was a while ago so yeah pick that one up now i picked these up as well these are like travel pocket tissues and they come in kind of like little funky patterns now obviously we're off to barcelona um, this one says I love London which I thought was really cute and um, these are just nice little thin ones that you can keep in your bag I think they were literally like 39p each this one this one's called humble vintage you can see that and then this one is got the sniffles well wow. you know Ooh. well I hope I don't have the sniffles so yeah, so the little pack, I don't know which one I'm going to take with me, but I'll be taking one to Barcelona and the other one, the other ones I'll use later. So I got those, I got the three. Now also in the skin range as well, I picked up some of that Rejuvenate and Plump, the Lip Plumper. Do I need it? Uh, so I thought I'd give that a go. These are like a pound each, so even if they don't work, I'm not too worried. But yeah, the um, Rejuvenate and Plump, it obviously fuller looking lips, moisturised and smooth, uh, not percent parabens, oh, really good. So yeah, I thought I'd give that a go. This is the balance range. And then I also picked up as well the gold collagen under eye masks. So I might do another um, pamper night or something and use these, yeah. 
that's balanced range as well so I picked those up and again I think they were like a pound each next up as well I picked up this um lovely face mask I clearly love my face mask there seems to be quite a lot of liquid in here as well which is uh, a bit worrying but this is a glitter one it's hydrogel pink hydrogel um it's hydrating collagen treatment so it's got a little selfie there so maybe people take selfies when they've got it on their face <laughs> so yeah i picked that one up and i think again that was like a pound they did loads of different ones actually so i kind of fancied that one right next up who knew that they had a little lucky dip now i've got no idea what's in here um as you can see this beautiful holographic bag now this is feeling lucky lucky dip and it can be one of the following a lip gloss an eyeshadow or body glitter so i haven't opened it um i don't know what's inside so i thought i would open it on camera right now and tell you what i said it was a pound 99 pence actually um let's have a look i seem to have glitter all over my knee i don't know why right oh oh right okay so it is a lip gloss actually it tells you what the other ones are here so you've got lip gloss and there are the other ones in the range so it kind of looks like that i think it's kind of like a clear gloss piece and pout made in china mm. okay doesn't smell of anything just looks like glossy Kind of like a shimmery liquid. You could definitely just wear it over the top of something else because there's not much of a colour to it. I know it kind of looks pink, but that pink isn't kind of coming out on anything. So, mm, not bad. So that was that. Right, I also picked up some of the Olivia Hale palette. Um, this one looks so good doesn't it look like the Urban Decay um, I actually thought that the packaging kind of looked like that obviously you can feel that the quality is not the same but I actually loved the colours in this palette um, they look absolutely amazing look at those sorry the brush is like stuck up there so those are the colours that's what it looks like I think it's lovely I'll definitely be using sort of these ones um, kind of like these nude actually I kind of like all of them they look really really nice um, some of them are kind of like shimmery as well like this one here um, and yeah I thought they looked good I kind of like these ones as well these kind of mauve top type ones but yeah really really nice colours I mean I don't know how well they apply to the skin but we'll, we'll see I'll have to test them out right next up as well I picked up this beautiful sort of mirrored uh, case uh, it's in a rose gold um i just loved this again i think was a pound this is the one that's kind of shedding the glitter i think there's like glitter falling out of it but yeah it looks absolutely stunning doesn't it and not really good price for a pound so i got that as well i thought it'd be handy to take to barca so yeah um really cute i have got other ones and oh, there's some lovely like crystals in there can you see that crystals and little gems and i think they look, look really really pretty so yeah i thought i'd um, pick one of those up right we'll get the boring things out of the way i picked up two lots of anodine anodine extra um for headaches right i also picked up a, a muslim face cloth i thought there was this was quite nice you know when you sort of after you've sort of cleansed your skin with your cleanser and you need to sort of wipe off some of the residue with a with a wet muslin cloth or a wet flannel i thought it'd be good to sort of use one of these i think they were less than a pound like 69p or something so i picked that one up as well it might be good to take away as well right next up as well and again this is where the glitter's coming from is that i found this now all the christmas stuff is out as well in home bargain it was amazing obviously halloween's definitely out but all the christmas stuff well not all of it but there's a good start of christmas decorations and i was so tempted to buy something but i thought you know what it is still too early at the moment but this is actually out of the christmas range uh, but i thought it was amazing um it's gonna go in the living room actually but i think it looks absolutely stunning this is vanilla and orchid 
it smells beautiful it looks beautiful uh, i'm gonna put this downstairs although the glitter is literally falling off it um and i'm covered in it right now so um that'll have to go downstairs soon right next up as well i picked up this which was like it's a little plant um it looks so cute with the little rock garden and everything obviously it's plastic um but um it looks dead cute and really real i think my mum has actually got a real one in like a triangle sort of glass shape and this kind of looks real i thought it looked cute um looks really really rustic and nice so i don't know where i'm gonna put it yet but um i'm gonna see where i can position this but i will find a home for it for sure because i thought it was cute they did a different one as well with a slightly different plant in it and um, which again i was going to buy both but then i thought where am i going to put them so you know one and then if i do find a place and i need two then i'll go and pick up the other one but yeah that was that again um i think it was uh, yeah so this was two pound 49 for that um it's called the cactus apparently so yeah thought that was nice right next up as well i picked up this color changing candle now how the hell does this work so um let's get it opened so it looks like that which looks really nice now it says releases aromas and gently changing color creating a relaxing ambiance now should we light this and see if it works and the bargain thing is it was 149 so let me go and get it lit and let's see if it does actually color change right i'm going to leave that burning for a little bit i'm going to pop it here and let's see if it uh, changes color while we're talking so getting towards the end i also picked up one of these unstoppable by febreze candle now this is in lavish vanilla they only have this one scent is it changing color does it look red at the bottom? I don't know whether I'm imagining it. Um, sorry, where was I? Yeah, this. So, um, yeah, this is a Unstoppables Lavish Vanilla. I don't mind vanilla, actually. I think it's actually quite a nice smell. It actually smells really nice. So I got that as well. It comes in quite a big jar. Again, this was, I think it was one forty nine. Yeah, one ninety nine for this one. So yeah, that's how much that one was, which I thought was an absolute bargain. Right, last but not least, I picked up another one of these little flower arrangements. Um, obviously, I've got this one here. I wanted one for my bathroom as well because I recently filmed um, an evening routine. I had to borrow that one. So I bought a new one, which was four ninety nine. Thought it was really good. Love the flowers. Um, looks, it's a peony in a tall vase. I thought that was really cute. I know you can probably make these yourselves, but four ninety nine. Not gonna grumble. Yeah, so that was that. Uh, now, I don't know whether you can see this. And before I say goodbye, does this look like it's changing colour to you? Let's just have a closer look. Shall I turn out the light? Can you see the red at the bottom? See this red? Oh my God. Let's move those books away. Oh, what color is it now? It's blue. Oh my God, it's blue. <laughs> wow. How the hell does that work? Oh my God, I want another one and it's red. See the red? Can you see that? How much it's glowing? It's not. It's so red here where I'm looking. It is so red, and now it's changing again to blue again. Blue. Oh my god, that is amazing for like one forty nine. <laughs> oh, let me just put the light back on. Ooh right that's everything for the video i hope you enjoyed it if you want to give me a big thumbs up that would be brilliant if you want to subscribe you can do it in the link below don't forget to follow me on instagram and um, i put my details on the screen i think it's this side i keep getting the wrong side and that's it for the video so thanks to all my new subscribers and all my returning subscribers and i'll see you all in the next video bye